Hi Goggle. Why are you looking so worried? Hi Toggle. Look at this keyboard Toggle. How do I use it? It has got so many buttons with letters, numbers and symbols. Can you help me? Sure Goggle. You know, a keyboard is used to write on the computer. All these buttons with letters or numbers on them are called keys. Keys? The only keys I know are the ones we open doors with. Haha, <laughs> these keys are different. They are used to type on the computer by pressing them. You can press the letters of your name on the keyboard and it will appear on the screen. Aha! Nice! Toggle, can you tell me more about the different keys on the keyboard? Sure, Goggle. Now pay attention here. The alphabet keys are used for typing words and sentences. Okay, but not all the keys have letters on them. Look, there are also numbers written on some of the keys. You are right, Goggle. These are number keys and are used to type in numbers. The number keys are also known as numeric keys. One set is located just above the alphabet keys. There is another set on the right side of the alphabet keys. Ok, what's that long key at the bottom? It has nothing written on it. The long key you see at the bottom of the keyboard is the space bar. Ok, what is it used for? The space bar is used to insert blank spaces or gaps between two words or letters as you type. Now type your name on the computer and press the space bar and type my name in the next line. Toggle, how can I move to the next line? Ah, good question. To go to the next line, you need to press the enter key. The wide key you see on the right in the second row of the alphabet letter keys is the enter key. So, this is the enter key. But there is another enter key on the right side of the keyboard. But its shape is different. Yes, there are two enter keys on a keyboard. Both are meant for the same purpose. Oh no! Toggle, I have typed an H instead of a G. What do I do now? No problem, Goggle. Use the backspace key to erase H and then type G. Oh, that's cool, Toggle. If you make a mistake, the backspace key and the delete key help you correct the mistake. Wow! Can you tell me more about these two keys? Sure, Goggle. That is the backspace key. When you press this key, it erases anything typed on the left side of the cursor. Really? That's what you did when you pressed the backspace key to remove the H earlier. Remember? Oh, yes. Okay, let's take another example. Write computer C-O-M-P-P-U-T-E-R and then to correct the spelling, Place the cursor after the first P and then use the backspace key to erase the extra P. Cool! And the delete key? That is the delete key. When pressed, the delete key erases anything typed on the right side of the cursor. So, if I need to use the delete key to correct the spelling of computer, C-O-M-P-P-U-T-E-R, to computer, C-O-M-P-U-T-E-R, 
I just have to place the cursor after M and then press the delete key to erase one of the P. Yes, Google, you are right. Try it out. It works, Toggle. Thank you. Now I know so much about the keyboard. Any time, Google. Bye for now.